Hey everybody, it's me, Son Jones here. Welcome back to another episode of Life is Strange Double Explore. Now, long story short, I have recorded this pretty much a few hours ago, but my damn recording got re corrupted and I couldn't really edit most of the part of the video. So, what you're gonna probably and my fucking voice had cut off again. All we see is probably like at least a less editing video of this damn playthrough. Because, well, of course, that I'm now on chapter 5. But I'm going to be playing it for you guys, etc, etc. Because a lot of shit went down on this episode. And it was so fucking crazy. But it will not be taking me that long to like get through this chapter. So, expect this to be like around like one hour or probably like 50 minutes or something like that like a 50 minutes or just a one hour mark type of episode well further ado let's get into it last time we basically figured out that selfie basically cloned it maps which was so fucking surprising now we're about to figure out what the fuck is going on so Let's do this shit. Chapter 4. Dipped. I can't even pronounce the name. Don't mind me. I can't pronounce the name. I'm sorry. Another copyright music, of course. My God, it's all through technically on um, framey, man. And she got cut. Um, getting lake water on your sofa. Shit. Right. I uh, should change. And by no means, though, we're in the live world. The live world of selfie, though. Just need to go upstairs and put on something dry. My god, this it really got me so intense, so though, for this episode. Some. Like, I really cannot wait to play episode 5 after this, though, because I'm definitely going to be doing that. Um, let's go, go to our real timeline. But, um, uh, yeah, I'm pretty much going to play two episodes and just make this, like, less editing, because, like, I want to, like, you know, get done and over with, though, for this game. I already, like, play it. But, I mean, I heard a lot of, like, crazy so much I want to comments about how this game is just not good because of mass character, etc, etc. Either way, though, as much as, like, a lot of shit going on with this damn game, though, I still love Life is Strange. I like this game. But, you know, Life is Strange fans just, etc, etc, just, just care so much about, like, representing these characters like that. Like, uh I'm not even a deck. I like no matter what though, Deck Knight and Donon make these games so so crazy. Like, yeah. You're what happened a on the shifter. Yep, I'm the shapeshifter. Yep, yeah, it's powers. I knew it. Here. We all knew it. The bottle cap has to answer a question. Huh. Clever little minx, you. <laughs> Deal. Let's play. All right. How the station work? Exactly. Do you 
shapeshift. It's got something to do with perception. Manipulating how others see me and hear me. Like right now, I can kind of feel the part of your brain that senses me. And if I nudge it... Oh my god, man. Yup. Still creepy. Are the teens using creepy to mean awesome nowadays? Whoa. It's like she walked across my brain for a second. <laughs> oh. So. Are you like that girl in Frozen? Ice powers and musical numbers. No. No. There's a world parallel to this one that I can access. I am switched that world's icy lake with our broken one. Hang on. Parallel world? It's the same as this one, except... You're dead. You're... dead. Okay. I'm gonna need a moment with that one. This you? Were you gonna say something? Sorry. Feels like it's her, man. I'm telling you. She has to be the one playing me. Future, I think I'm going to travel back to the moment you took this photo. And... Shoot you. Because Mask was literally uh, on her way to go I see her. Figure out why and, and then suddenly that happened. Present. Let's come back to this. Give me the bottle cap. Alright. How you always been How long have you had your power? Face it, face it, uh, since high school? Right Damn. after dad left. He got her powers when she was oh, young once, like Matt. Broken. Well, different perspectives. And the way she dealt with being broken was to make sure I wasn't. That was a project. Proof that she didn't need him to do something right. That's a lot to put on a kid. Yeah, don't I know it. God, I remember wishing <laughs> so much I could just be the way she wanted me, magically, instead of struggling all the time and still falling short. Then I started wishing I could be someone else entirely. Someone who didn't have to carry all that weight. Then, one day, I could. <sighs> My mom, she can wait. So, you said something about traveling back to a moment? Can you? Yes. Clarify? The truth is, in my teens, I could 
Rewind time. Shit. Time travel too? You're really white privileged into all the cool powers. You'd think so. But rewinding was... A burden. Way, way too much responsibility. Control zing your way through adolescence? Literally the worst years of life? <laughs> that's not a responsibility, that's a dream. Mm. Until it isn't. And then your whole life is a nightmare. My turn again, huh? <laughs> Are you able to transform into anyone else? Can you oh god. Turn into anybody? Uh only if I've met them IRL. Trying to guess who I've been? Go ahead. I'll answer those for free. Alright. When? That was you impersonating Gwen and dealing drugs to students. Not like she didn't deserve it. Your book deal. When I got the news, it was canceled. She was the first person I called. She said she didn't know anything about it. When she started Damn. reading my texts, I knew it was mask off time. Hell, I started to think you were in on it, too. That's why I came tonight. To see what you were hiding. Why didn't you tell me you knew Gwen killed it? Well, then. Looks like we already, like, well, let Sophie know about this whole entire thing. Oh boy. And like, damn, we already said that shit from episode two. And that's what's funny. You shouldn't have had a break on my house. You broke into my house. Are you really judging me here? I guess we're even. Seriously, Max, I thought you were covering for Gwen. I thought I couldn't trust you anymore. But actually, I was just trying to prevent your murder in another timeline. Yeah, that's <laughs> honestly a relief. <laughs> I mean, that... <sighs> By the way, we can actually have Luke, and we can actually have Amanda... Did you in my second place there? change into Lucas and ruin things with his soul? Wait, oh wait, actually we can. I thought Lucas was involved in canceling my book. I gave him a chance to come clean. He didn't. But I don't think it's gonna happen though. I guess I understand. Lucas could be taken down a peg. Or three. He's still successful, still tenured, and still a man. He'll be okay. Alright. Oh, there it is. Um, Vin, Moise, Amanda. There was a moment talking to Amanda today that felt a little... different. Look... You were snooping around. I needed to know why. It was self-defense. Bro, that's just crazy. We can forget about this time, but... Can you not do that again? So I basically just kissed Sophie then. Amanda. 
I basically kiss kiss Sophie. Are you kidding me? Fair. That's crazy. So you basically all that time at that that damn place though, I was kissing Sophie, but it was basically Sophie's powers doing it. So I may be wrong. I may be wrong. I could be su I could be stupid. I could be so stupid. Uh voice. What about shape shifting into Moses? No. He's off limits. Not that I couldn't, but you know, it's Moses. Um me? So that was actually you trying to get into Vin's phone. Mmm. If anyone deserves an acting award, it's me. I thought he was just trying to get rid of anything tying him to the cow skull fiasco. So that was him. Guess he's still not over me. Um, that's messed up. Nothing says take me back like vandalism. Kids don't spray paint their names in hearts anymore. I guess I should let you ask me something now. All right, so you used to time travel and now you can switch timelines? What, what changed? You know how I don't talk about where I'm from? Well, where I'm from is gone because of me. I saw an article about Arcadia Bay in your memories box. That was a freak I storm. In. I was the freak and I was the storm. My powers went haywire and I had a choice. Save the town or save the girl that I Yeah, I chose boy. her. The blue haired girl. Hearing her, seeing her get shot in a dirty high school bathroom. I couldn't live with that. So I undid it. And a whole town died. didn't dare use my powers again. Ah, uh, damn. Not till I got here. Oh, damn well. When other no, not be going through this shit. No matter where she goes. My powers have changed. And this is yeah. only just the actions that she makes. Now since she's here, it's all just more different. But still repeating the, way, the same as it did. Moses on the other side gave me that bottle cap. To give to you. Moses knows? Well, not everything. He knows about me and you being alive. Not the shape changing, obviously. He told me to tell you to stay safe. I'm trying. I should probably tell you about Maya. Maya Okada was my best friend. God, we were such a pair. <laughs> she was so fucking smart, dude, and the best writer I've ever known. What Lucas did to her, stealing her work, it essentially killed her. 
And as incandescently angry as I am at Lucas, at everyone, I'm so much angrier at myself. God, I, I told her to stay quiet about it. <laughs> My Jesus. silence catapulted Lucas fucking Colmenero to literary stardom and sent Maya to an early grave. You said you were mad at everyone about it. Still am. Um, Gwen, do Gwen again. Including Gwen? Gwen was the one who said to put my anger into poetry. That poetry became All the Daughters We Don't Talk About. Your book. Yep. And at the 11th hour, she got cold feet. Um, uh, her mother. Does that include your mom? She told me to tell Maya to keep quiet, and she protected Lucas. We've talked it through a little since then. I don't hold it against her. Not really. Vin's statement. Bingo. He was supposed to be Maya's friend. But Caledon said jump. At least I have the humanity to regret asking how high. I'm hazy on the connection between all this and your book. Every piece in that collection was about Maya. Or about what happened to her. Now since we learn about Maya. Guess I told it a little too clearly. Probably. And when Gwen showed her true know colors about Maya, and pulled the plug on the book, I had to find some other path to vindication. Gwen, Lucas, Ben, your revenge tour. My justice tour. Safi, what if... What if that justice tour goes wrong? What if it spirals out of control? What if eventually it's the reason I... What? This photo? That I don't remember taking? Dude, do you even own a gun? No, but... Great! Don't buy a gun. Problem solved. I don't understand how you can be so chill about this. I don't understand how you could be such a bummer about it. Max, we have fucking superpowers. You keep talking like you're cursed, but you're not. You're in control. You and me, we're more in control than most people. Hey, look at me. Tell me honestly. Do you really think that you're capable of hurting me like that? No. No. I don't think so. Or maybe, I hope not. To start, <laughs> I trust you, Max Caulfield. Enough for both of us. But Safi, we can't just cross our fingers. We have to do something. What do you propose? Lucas, justice for Maya. You wrote a whole book about it. And that book is dead. The book is... You aren't. I can still expose Lucas. We can. Damn right. When you tried to expose him before, you were alone. Now there's two of us. We've got powers, and we've got proof. Krampus on campus. Shit, that's tonight. Everyone will be there, and you'll be expecting a mock trial. You won't be expecting us. <laughs> Wanna nail well, he's like not. Hold to the wall. I've never wanted anything more. 
Here we go. Let's do this. I'm here at Krampus, but shit. I'm still reeling. Safi has powers. Here we go. She can literally nudge people's brains to see what she wants them to see. Yeah. And Lucas. Power is that fucking broken. Lower like ours, but Versus is a lot more but open wise. Everyone will know what he did. And Maya will get the justice she deserves. <laughs> okay, some of these decorations scream not safe for work. It's Krampus. Every year it gets even more like a Halloween rager. What? Okay. That's why I like it. It's not really giving me the cheery holiday feels that I expect this time of year. Why not? The guy with the tongue carries a bag. Just like Santa. Is the gingerbread house part of the plan? Hilarious. No. The plan is when it's time to roast Lucas, we'll swap out their toothless slideshow with mine. Spend all day on it. It's got all the evidence I have of what Lucas did to Maya. We'll play it while he's on stage, in front of everyone. What's wrong? Just promise me we'll nail him this time. Of course. He's not slithering out of this. Not between the two of us and other Moses. You're right. He's fucked. So, how do we pull this off? Looks like Reggie's running the projector. We need someone who's willing to run the slideshow without asking questions. And not piss themselves when Lucas gets mad. I'll see how Reggie's feeling. Next up, Ben. He's the MC tonight. So we'll need his help. Think you can talk him into it? Ben and I have history. And that leaves Gwen. Be nice to have her support. She hates Lucas as much as I do. But I doubt she'd listen to me. You're not on great terms, but... Huh. I can try. You're damn right. Let me know when you're done. Enjoy the party! Alright. <laughs> Gotta act natural. I see you, Sophie. Operation okay, talk to Reggie and talk to Gwen. Sorry, Gwen. I'll probably have to. Amanda. I'd love to, but. Sounds scream. But I'm afraid of dealing with something at that moment. Let me get back to you, okay? Sure. You okay? Yeah, nothing I can handle. Alright, so we're gonna talk to Reggie. Hey, Reggie. You manning the projector tonight? <laughs> Babysitting, more like. The school only agreed to let us use Olga here if someone kept an eye on her at all times. Oof. Not what you had planned for Krampus. Reggie, how would you feel about... Um... Help us with a break, being relieved with your duties. Letting someone else worry about the projector tonight. Yeah, right. It'll be on me if something goes wrong. This thing is probably worth more than my whole tuition. So, so ma'am, uh, please, gonna need you a few steps back. Yes, sir. Okay, Reggie's not going to cut it. 
But if something went wrong with that projector, and Moses was the only one who could fix it... Right. So... How can I make sure I only break it in a way that this Moses can fix? Looks like... Wait, do we have a test message against her? I'm no. I should let Moses have a little more time oh, with Diamond okay, before so... I drag him into things. Ask the dead more for help. Stop. Wait, hold on. Let me look at the damn thing again. Okay. Talk to Gwen. Okay, let's go ask for, um... Wait, actually, let's go talk to Gwen first. I'm... Where is she at? She's over... Yeah, she's over here. Hey. What is it, Max? Sophie has a plan to tell the truth about Lucas's book during the roast. It would be a lot more credible if someone from the faculty backed us up. All I wanted was one last drink before I left this place forever. I hope you two get him, but I didn't sign up to confront anybody tonight. Hey, I... <laughs> I totally get that. Alright, Grandma, we know. I'll still miss you. I can't picture this place without you. <sighs> we'll see each other again. I don't intend to slip that easily into obscurity. I hope... Whatever you do, it's so successful, you can rub it in everyone's face later. I'll miss that optimism. It's that optimism. How much for being a team? Yeah. Tim. So, we're gonna go talk to Moise in the other what world. This was delinquent. Hey, how do I, um, Max. There we go. All right, let's go talk to Moise in the Earth world. So we're doing good so far. All right, there goes the other Amanda. Let's go. Hey, Moses. How's your first Krampus? It's weird. It's incredible. This thing is incredible. It's amazing. Red lights everywhere and baby doll heads on the tree. It's. Anyway, that's not why we're here. Did you guys figure out a plan? Yes, we did, but it's already falling apart. We require Mozai assistance. I need to get other Reggie to let other Moses control the projector instead. Okay. I was thinking if something went wrong with it. So it's got to go wrong in a way that's right for me to fix it. Exactly. Do you know which projector it is? Reggie called it... Olga? Olga can be... particular. If he goes to the other side and listen, I can walk you through jamming it from here. You might be better at my powers than me. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> come back and let me know if it works. His powers just basically come yeah. from the brain. He just has big brain power. That's Better it. get into position. I don't want to miss Moses's instructions. New message for me, Asmin. Oh hell no! Nah. What the hell she wants? I'm sorry, Barry, but I don't have anything else to talk about. Talk to. It's okay. I get it. Um, Father Golanjing. My God. Okay, so Moyes basically said it. Yeah, I know. Detective Van Ender was never born into- Oh! Oh, this is the previous message! Oh, this was like literally the previous- the previous message that we probably did. Wait a second. Wait, right, never mind. Oh, it was! It was. Yeah, this is- this is the same message that we already went through. I'll see you guys in a second. <laughs> was going so well. <gasps> was it the roses? I'm so glad I didn't out, out of the picture, bro. Alright, 
All right, we're back. So, oh, um, tempted the projector. Uh, yeah, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. All right. <clears throat> How the fuck are we gonna do this? Oh, right. I need temporary. Reggie's eyes off that projector long enough for me to get my hands on it. Huh. They're chummy. Maybe Diamond can help me out. Alright, let's go test Damien. Ask him about that record, Reggie. About the whole situation, I meant to say. When do I get out of it? A gold star sticker for your nice paper. Bet, I'm holding you to that. There's two ways I know for sure it will work out, neither of which is gonna be fun for our guy. Reggie is never is never not stressing about his grades, so if there's an assignment, he's missed it, he'll start sweating over that. Reggie's also never not stressing over Vin. Foles are too bad for each other. To hear him tell tell it, they got it bad for each other, so it's up to you how you want to play it. Nah, we gotta play it more smart. Let's focus on his homework, yeah. Keep it classy, guys. Reggie's officially Let's go. distracted. I should be good to go now. I hope Moses is ready on the other side to give me instructions. So now you gotta listen to what Morse gotta say. Maybe Reggie did see her. Did she have talked to him? Okay, how long did that take? Max, you there? Man, this feels silly. If you're there, start by opening the control hatch. It should be on the right side. Alright, so we gotta open the hats. You mean there are more controls? You feel kind of like a spy. Do you feel like a spy? Oh, Moses. Okay, Max, you back? If yes, switch to focus mode to menu. If no, I... If no, I'm not really sure. Just keep talking to myself, I guess. Alright. What's the focus mode manual? So All right. Good. What's my next step? Shouldn't take snaps. Right? Click one switch. Yeah. Max. Next, make sure the focus dial is turned all the way to the left. All right. Turn the focus on the now on the left. Still needs to be a little more to the left. There we go. This looks like it's in the right spot. All right, now for the next one. I'm giving you an extra second or two. You probably turn the knob all the way to the right at first by mistake. Hey. All right, Max. Final step. Just hit calibrate. <laughs> After a few seconds, you should hear the motor stick. I can't believe I just did that. I'm sorry, Elda. All right, so now I gotta press this button. Sorry, Reggie. All right. But this is one omelet we have to make. No, 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 shit. <laughs> what is happening? Oh, God. <laughs> well, that's it for that damn shit. Now, let me stop. It's not done with that. That damn um machine. Hey so guys. now we gotta talk to hey. Moist from this world. Oh, Damon's like, oh yeah, she's ready. Plus the project. Hey, Moses, I need a favor. I think Reggie's on the brink of ruining school property. Oh, it's Olga. Everyone thinks she's finicky, but she's just. Rain check. Sure. Duty calls. Hey, Reggie, I found help. I, I, I don't know what happened. One minute she's fine, and the next she's yelling at me like she's my mom. <laughs> There's your problem. <laughs> the focusing motor is stuck. <laughs> Maybe take the night off, Reggie. I think Moses has it from here. Really? Are you sure? Yeah, Max. You sure? We need a pro. 
yeah, this is Krampus we're talking about. We need a pro. You need a pro to press next on the projector? Everything has to be perfect for the roast. Okay. If you're sure. <laughs> Thanks, Moses. You saved my life. <laughs> You're being all maxi. What's afoot? Me and Safi are hijacking the roast tonight. And we need your help to run this. The roast thing. tonight? We have good reason. You'll see. Yeah, Moist. Right. Moist is like. Alright, fine. I trust, trust her. You. I should talk to the other Moses. Alright, time to talk to the other Moise. That's from the other world, let's go. Alright. Hey. There we go. So his plan has worked. It worked. Other you is in place and ready to go. Nice. Where'd you get this house? Aren't they from the party? Amanda saved me a kid. She knew Safi and I really got into it last year. Last piece. Oh, damn. Chimney broke. I wonder how it tastes. I bet I can find an extra chimney on the other side. Just... Just hang on. Yeah, find it? I should talk to... Oh, it's a second objective. Coffee, eh, nah. I ain't gonna do that. Probably I'll do that shit on my own time. Alright, let's go. Now we gotta talk to Sophie. Let's go. Oh, the gingerbread house. We're ready to go. Fine, doing it. Is he. Part of your merry band? Yeah, I am. I wasn't able to convince Gwen. Figures. Don't worry about it. We've got bigger problems. Why? What's going on? Lucas is about to call the whole thing off. He's out on the patio freaking out. He's supposed to announce his movie deal tonight. I guess he's worried it's too good to be true. Okay, so what do we do? Better be quick. Guy's two ticks away from calling an Uber. Fuck! I'm gonna go stall him. You figure something out, Max. Good luck. What's she doing? Uh, yes. Is that Safi? Yep. <laughs> That's definitely Come on Safi. now. It yeah, is her. I'd say she Safi. has the power. Out on the patio. So now we're gonna play along with Sophie's little plan. Let's go. So, uh, remind me what the plan is again. You teeny tiny. I'll be quick. How did you find success after years of mediocrity? Loretta? I've talked about this in my workshops, Loretta. Don't you remember? Here is what matters. Here is rarely understood. Critics rarely understand genius when it first appears. That's... Yes. That's a common refrain in great art. It's been years since Water Beast was published. Have you settled for an early retirement? One book is enough. Wilder Beasts than these? was a triumph. It doesn't matter if he never comes up with another idea in his life. Uh, but of course, I still have plenty of ideas. Besides, there's a reason Lucas needs to focus back on Wilder Beasts for now. Oh, really? If you stick around for the Krampus roast, you can be the first to break the news. Right, Lucas? Uh, yeah, that's right, for sure. Nice work, Loretta. 
Thanks for your time, Professor. For a moment there, it almost seemed like you were trying to insult me. No, of course not. Well, anyway... You trying to get on my point. good side again? Just tell him the truth. Just trying to yeah, we're just pointing through our fucking hands. We're just... He's point. He's literally just pointing Public through our hands. Deserves the truth about your work. Absolutely. I'll let you in. I almost called off the event before you got here. You on your big name? <laughs> yeah, I know. If my old man could see me, he'd tell me to man up and get in there. <laughs> he was an author too, you know, Roberto Colmenero. Come on, then. I deserve this. I should stop stalling. Go get him. Why is he hiding? Oh my god, he got a gun! Oh shit! R.C. Roberto Colmenero. Great job, partner. Although, I thought you were gonna puke there for a second. Lucas has a gun. Ew, what the fuck? I'm all for having a gun. It belonged to his father. Safi, this is bad. Jesus, Max, you might shoot me, Lucas might shoot me. America has a problem. I told you, Max. I trust you. How are we going, bro? Here, I'll hold on to it. Happy? Thanks. Oh, uh, she just like just got the gun. Just imagine we we can like have a choice to get the gun. That will be crazy. <laughs> Let's welcome our guest of honor, Professor Lucas Colmanero. Fair warning, he's going to say a few words before we start, so I hope everyone's already halfway to waste. <laughs> no hard feelings, bro. Thanks, Vin. I, uh... I wanted to announce some surprising news. No. Yeah. My world renowned. Let's fuck this boy show. Hmm. <laughs> was like, oh, what the hell? Bro. That's not right. That's Maya, bro. She looks so cute. This? Not your past, Lucas. Your former student, Maya Okada. Now that's odd. <laughs> I thought this was a presentation about your book. Would you care to explain what Maya's doing up there instead? These are not my slides. No. And this man being in denial. Um, let me help you out. <laughs> the beast rose. Oh boy. Stared into me. It became. Yeah, we got him. We got wherever we want him. I had always been the beast. <laughs> Powerful words from Caledon's famous pet novelist. Am I right? What do we all think? Boo! <laughs> Ooh. Oh, thank you. At least someone remembers this is a roast. Yeah, this roast Wait is going to get real this heated. Might be the clue we were looking for. So, what do we have here? Maya Okada's draft. Wait a minute. Maya 
wrote that sentence? That, that, that page, for real? Yes, for real. But you already know that. Because every word of your venerated novel belongs to Maya Okada. What the hell are you doing? This is slander. Every word oh boy, yeah. He's saying for real because he, he knows. That's why he only wrote one book. I can't believe this. That's why the one book. You were right. It's working. I need to get away with this. You don't know what you're talking about. Try me. Oh boy. All right. All right. Let's rein this in. <laughs> now, we wouldn't want this roast to end in any actionable legal threats. <laughs> uh, continue, please. As some of you must surely know, Maya Okada was a beloved former student of mine who tragically took her own life. The thought of her death being politicized and used as, as a cudgel, beyond disrespectful. Maya believed in my work. She believed in me. I knew this would fucking happen. Said, what are you doing? I'm changing it to Ven. I'll make Lucas fess up myself. Sophie, wait. Really this is your chance to tell everyone God. your side. Shouldn't you go up there as yourself? Are you serious right now? Right. If speaking my truth worked, we wouldn't be here. I am serious. Superpowers aren't the answer to every problem. I would know. With the rest of Caledon. Fuck. As of next year, Wilder BCDs All right. will be adapted into a feature. Trust you. Film. We have to get in this time, Max. So, this is Vin's turf, not cameras, mine. Friends. Make my day. Do you really think I should go up there as myself? Or Vin or go ask herself. Nah, she has every right to do this. I'm gonna just say it's right now. Go for it. Can do this. You can do this. Fuck. Don't be nervous. Honestly, it's not. Don't be fun. nervous. Here we go. Safi. Did you forget that I was actually there? That at one point we were all friends? You, me, and Maya? I trusted you. Was that all a lie too? You're trying to turn me into this monster. I watched you tour the country, win awards for the work you stole from her. Hello. I watched her beg you to stop. I watched you kill her. Now you expect me to watch you profit off her grave? Yeah, and what about you? If what I did was really so bad, you would have said something back then. You didn't. Oh, shit. What was your excuse? Exactly. And what young Safi here doesn't understand is it... It wasn't stealing. Authors frequently take... Uh, inspiration from one another. I was going to give her credit. But then she... Think about what I was going through at that time. My divorce, my son, this. Oh, wow. this Everybody is doing on this man. <laughs> you. 
you were right. They listened to me. Just me. Of course they did. You're you. <laughs> Damn, she really just you don't did all that. This means to me. That is crazy. I'm just happy to share this moment with you. Okay, enough. Let's celebrate! Hey! <laughs> we need to talk. Alone. Ah, shit. And before you say, fuck off, you'll want to hear this. Relax. I'm the one packing, remember? I'll be fine. Wait for me. I'll be over with Moses when you're ready. Lucas and Sophie? That can't be good. Yep, that's a bad combo. I, I do not like where this Moses is going. Know how it went. Oh, tell the dead, the dead more is the good news. We got him. We got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. What I would have given to see it. How is Sophie? Surprised. Surprised, I think. She's not used to people listening to her and believing her. You should get back. She don't need you. Us. She knows you're still here for her, too. All right, so we should be going back to the living world. So we go to talk to Moist from that timeline. All right, let's go. Oh, that made my entire year. Mine too. So that's what yeah. you've been planning this whole time. Wait, where's Sophie? Where's Sophie? Sophie wanted the truth, so I gave it to her. All of it. You don't even know what the fuck you just did, do you? What I did? What was that about? Oh shit! My head! It, it was my, my book! Oh my god! Everything! I can't! I can't! I can't believe you! Believe I can't you do this! You lied to me! You lied, you lied to me! me. You lied, you lied to, to me! me. You lied to oh me. my god! This is getting crazy! You lied to me. Bro, her power is going crazy. You lied to me. You lied to me. You lied to me. You lied to me. Oh boy, here we go. Oh my god. I do not like where this is going. Oh my god, I hear the fucking storm. Alright, we gotta go find Soft. This is really getting crazy. Oh, there goes the storm. Oh my god. A storm. We gotta save her. Oh no. Now it's getting to Max. Now it's affecting Max. Pull yourself together, Max. It's getting worse. Pull yourself together. People's headaches are getting worse. Alright. We really need to get over there. My god, her power is just like a like going through everyone. Like Jeez, I could just think that she probably is the one that's creating the alternate timeline. But I am could be so wrong from that shit. She's literally just... He's just... Wow. 
I don't know how to put this. He's okay. Never mind. I, I have nothing else to say. Up there. I have to oh hurry. shit! Get softy. Holy shit. Oh my god, bro. This is getting intense without a minute, bro. Almost there. Hold on, please. I was trying to say you were trying to protect me. Say it one more time. I fucking dare you. Don't do this. Stay back! Oh, whoa, 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 hold on, hold on, Salfi. Don't do this. Salfi, listen to me. You're losing control. Something's happening to your powers. You're losing control. All this time I've been trying to get justice and she's the one who's been getting in the way. Not Gwen, my own fucking mother. It was you? You canceled her book deal? The book was just her yeah, latest twisted Yeah, it was the reason. She's been doing this for years. She has to be the reason. There's no way. You deserve better than what I- Oh my god. Oh my god. The power is going crazy. Bro. This does not need to be this way. And yep, there's the storm. Remember what I told you about Arcadia Bay? About the storm? It's happening again. Don't do this to me. I can't do this again, Sophie. I can't sit by and watch everything get wiped away. Please, don't make me. Max, she kept me from seeing my dad. And she made me think it was his idea. How fucked up is that? You don't understand. This world can be so cruel. How's this for cruel? The only time in my entire life that you were controlling me was when I wasn't even me. Happy tea. Oh, oh my god, it's freaking out again. Oh my god. Yep, it's losing control. Oh my god, Sophie! Who the fuck do you think you are? And her nose is bleeding. Mother. One day you will understand. Shut up! I've done everything for you. Shut up! Oh my god. Oh man, yep. Here comes the choice. Rush the selfie or talk her down? I think it's just best to talk her down. Talk no jutsu. Talk no jutsu. Activate it. This isn't you, Sophie. That was me. was the only choice I've ever really had. What's happening to you? Ah! No! Oh! And you still got sh Oh no! Ah! No! Help her! Ah! Oh my god. All the voices. I failed. I didn't stop this. Oh no, she's Bro, the sound effects and everything. Holy shit. Oh god, she's taking her hand and everything. He's going into the picture. 
Oh, she's about to go right to the pitcher. What she's about to do? Holy shit. Well then, this was a crazy ass chapter. Holy shit. Are you guys ready for the final chapter? That means that we are going to be entering the final chapter of this game. I am not prepared for this. Well, until then, this is just going to be crazy. I cannot wait to see the conclusion for this damn game. But until then, I will see you guys in a second. Because we're about to do the final chapter. Which is, that's going to be in the moment. See you.